what people think is that the solar panels are the things that are actually powering your house. And that's not entirely true. It's a mix of the energy storage. The amount of sunlight, the energy from the sun that falls on our roof, it's just a tremendous amount of energy. And we have the ability to capture that energy. The challenge is storage. It's about 30 kilowatts of battery storage. And this will give us about a day to two days of power if we have a storm or really cloudy days. I think what's interesting is that the system is very reliable. We have not had to use a generator in well over a year at all. I think people are just surprised to learn that you can run an entire modern home just off of solar power and batteries and with, with very little hiccups. This greenhouse is kind of like the main greenhouse. Like again, the same approach as the house. We've, we've got gutters all the way around it. And when it rains, the, the water drops off the back. It goes into a reservoir that's just a, a pond liner. And then it, we, we put a tarp over it just to keep the, the evaporation rate down so that we can use that water all year. But even something like this will still produce about five to 6,000 gallons a year just off of the roof of this. And that provides all the water that these plants will need. Okay, so for the greenhouses, we started out with just little garden beds by the house. It was very amateurish. And I think I, I pulled a handful of spinach out of the first bed and I thought like, I'm a gardening master, you know? I, I was so excited about it. I was like, the first time I tasted it, I thought, oh, this changed my life.